You know, earlier this week, a friend of mine, a young guy uh, from Tucson, um, gave me a call, and we have a conversation, and he was a little bit down about the fact that in his business, he has this furniture business, that people weren't giving him the calls, you know, and um, um, I listened to him, and, and I thought about, boy, I know what that's like when it seems like our source is not, you know, happening for us, or we're not getting, if you have a, a regular job and you kind of plug in and you know that if you do this, you put this many hours in, you're going to get a paycheck or something like that. But for a lot of people that live in a more creative way and have these different kind of entrepreneurial business, they like their freedom, they like to set their own hours, they have their own little businesses or they find ways to bring income in, and that we go through those periods where um, it, that's, it seems it's not happening, that it's a test. And I've been doing that for over 50 years. So I know what that's like to go through uh, a cycle or a period of days or weeks, I mean, whatever it turns into, where uh, we start to think about and wonder, you know, wow, am I doing the right thing? Or is there something more that I can be doing? Am I lazy? Am I not being productive? Can I put more effort into this? Um, what is it? And, and I have learned over the course of years of doing that that oftentimes it's a way that spirit and God is trying to get my attention on some other part of my life or some direction that I'm not looking at. And that's not easy for the outer consciousness to kind of accept because we're so drawn to the um, material existence, and rightfully so. We, you know, we want to be productive. We want to do our share, pull our weight, um, you know, have balance on this plane, and yet in the life of spirit, some of that, it just doesn't matter sometimes. I mean, there's something at other times that we really have to go inward and figure out, you know, what kind of soul lesson am I going through right now, or am I missing some opportunity to perhaps expand my consciousness or um, be more involved in the lives of others or balance out some sort of energy or just look at something that I may not have be putting my attention on. So I think that that's important, and, and that's where there are some gifts. And I've always found that when I'm willing to go back to that and connect to spirit and connect to God, the humbleness and the awareness and the willingness opens up for me and source redirects us, and I've always been taken care of. Maybe not in the grand ways that we think, um, but certainly in ways that are fulfilling. And, and that's important, to trust and trust in, in God and our source and to learn, you know, where we're at right here and now. Okay, thanks.